How to download sound effects. I last made this video back in 2020, it's now 2023, so I thought I'd make a three year update video. Um, I still use the same site called My Instance, uh, but it has been reskinned a little bit. And I'm also on Windows 11 now, so I just thought I'd show an updated version of what that may look like uh, for somebody who's new using Windows 11 who's never done this before. So let's go ahead and get into it. So to begin, uh, from your preferred browser, for myself, I'm going to be using Google Chrome. Go ahead and in the address bar, just type out myinstance.com. From here, go ahead and hit enter. And it'll bring you to the myinstance.com website. From here, you'll be able to see that there are a ton of ads around the screen, as there usually are. Uh, Otherwise, you'll see all the different buttons here. These are all different sound effects that you can click on by pushing the button and then you'll be able to hear the sound effect. If there's a specific sound effect that you're looking for, you can always use the search bar in the upper left hand corner to hear a sound effect. As I said, just click on any of the buttons. So for example here, I'll click on the vine boom sound and you can hear it made the sound. Now let's say this is the sound that I want to download. All I'll go ahead and do is just click on the title for the button, Vine Boom Sound. Click on that. And it'll bring you to the page for that sound effect. Now if you want to hear it again, just to make sure it's what you wanted to hear, go ahead and click on the button. And it will play that sound effect one more time. I've now confirmed this is the sound effect that I want to download. You'll notice underneath the button here, Make sure to avoid any of these ads that may or may not pop up with download buttons. This can happen from time to time. I think my instance has done a pretty good job of keeping those ads out of their site. But what you're going to want to go ahead and do is click on the download MP3 option underneath the button. Should be directly underneath share, but this may of course change depending on the size of your web browser window. So go ahead and click on the download MP3 option. When you do this, for at least on Google Chrome, it will show up in the bottom left-hand corner showing that it has downloaded the MP3. Uh, if you're using Firefox, Safari, another web browser, it may show your download somewhere else. Usually you can find the file or the MP3 sound uh, downloaded within your downloads folder on your computer. So if I wanna open this up now, all I have to do is click on the downloaded option here in Chrome and it will open it up in Windows Media Player and instantly play it. Like I said before, if I wanna go find the sound and move it to a different folder, most of the time it will be in your downloads folder unless you've set different settings on your browser. So that is how you download sound effects, an updated version on Windows 11 on the newest version of my instance for 2023. Please like, subscribe, and comment down below if you have any questions or any other video ideas that you would like to be seen. I will, go, of course, answer those as quickly as I can and also get around to making those videos when possible. So thank you and have a nice day.